What's going on guys? Welcome back for another Two Minute Tuesday. Today we have a pretty cool video teaching you guys all about how you can quickly and super easily do a splatter paint on a pair of your boots, cleats, or any sneakers in general. But before we dive into today's tutorial, we wanna to talk to you guys about a new series that we plan on starting around here. As of now, it's roughly called the Custom Critique Corner where we wanna have a lot of different artists go ahead, send in their custom shoes, and we're just gonna go ahead and give some of our feedback. We think it's gonna be a really exciting series for the community where a lot of people are gonna be able to learn from actually having their stuff critiqued on camera and whatnot. So we're super excited about it. We need a few more volunteers for our first episode. So if you're interested, go ahead and fill out the form that we will have down below. It's gonna be the first link in the description. Thank you. But now let's go ahead and throw two minutes on the clock and dive right in. So before we can get into any painting, we definitely need to make sure that we have a nice clean prep surface before we can go ahead and do any splatter on top of it. Now we're gonna show you guys multiple different ways to create some really unique splatters today. The first one that I'm gonna be doing is just grabbing a brush that has some really long narrow bristles and then you're just gonna take some thinned out paint and we're gonna go ahead and just start whipping these at our shoes. And what's really cool about the splatter is it's totally free flowing and the more random it looks, that's when you're really gonna get much better results. So you're just gonna wanna practice quite a few different wrist motions and different depths from which you are from your subject in order to create quite a few different effects. With our next color, we're gonna grab the off end of a brush, dip that directly into our paint, and really go for like a sideways whip. And that's where you're gonna get these cool kind of stringed out splatter effects. Next, with our green color, I'm gonna be grabbing a flat paintbrush, and I'm trying to go for a little bit more of that tiny splatter effect, almost the type of effect that you could achieve with a toothbrush, or if you're going for like a starry galaxy look, but I really wanna to start to fill these up with a lot of this metallic green color. Now with our next few colors, I really wanna go for some of those bigger splatter chunks. So this is where I'm gonna use that off end of the paintbrush again, and really just whip at these from different distances. And that's how you're gonna kinda of create some of those bigger, larger splatter sections that I think really will help fill up this shoe nicely. One thing to really try to remember is that the goal here isn't to be precise at all. The best types of splatters are the ones that truly look the most random, where the colors are just all over the place and it just has this kind of fluidity to it. Once we start to get towards the end of these, one of the last effects that I'm gonna be doing is that tiny little speckle splatter print that we talked about where you're just gonna go ahead, grab an old toothbrush and just really flick at it with your thumb. And this is the best way for you to get the most tiny little splatter all the way around these. Just a little hint of that metallic gold everywhere is really gonna help these, I think. Now for finishers, I'm gonna go ahead and hit these with the Liquid Angelus Matte Finisher. And then I'm gonna go ahead and throw the Krylon Matte Spray on top of these. And now we're just gonna go ahead and give you guys a cool, quick look at how the untaping of these went down. All right, and now we gotta announce the winner of our Bape Vans giveaway. So across Instagram and YouTube, we had almost a thousand submissions. That is absolutely insane. We can't thank you guys enough for the support and helping us hit 25K subs here on YouTube. 
So the winner of the Bait Vans is going to be Jojo CA. Congratulations and we hope you enjoyed it. Now, if you guys didn't stick around to the end of that Bait Vans video, we announced that we were gonna be having three additional giveaways for three different Bait Vans stencil sets, which are really gonna help you make a pair just like we made in that last video. So the winners of those stencil sets are Panda Girl, Israel Soto, and Laser Dot. Congratulations guys, and we can't wait to see the pairs that you whip up with these stencil sets. So we hope you guys enjoyed today's splatter tutorial. Don't forget, if you're interested in being featured on the Custom Critique Corner, definitely go ahead and hit that first link in the description, fill out that form, and you'll hear from us shortly. So as always, thank you guys so much for your support, and we will see you guys in that next video.